Lord's Day. Wads of wisdom. New examples. Today, bizarre, bizarro world. I'm over at the coast. I'm gonna go to Flagler Beach to try to decompress from the damage done this weekend. Perpetrated by three adult women. One a friend who dropped an atomic bomb on me about our whatever the hell she had played it off as from friendship to dating back to friend zone. Uh, or said earlier in the video, definitely bizarre, uh, crazy men and women if you're watching. Men especially, you hear the word empath, run, run, run. Uh, I'm just, I'm all out of sorts. Uh, PTSD setting in maybe. So I'm just sitting out here watching fireworks before I go over to the beach. Uh, contemplating what had happened today. Uh, two of these elderly women uh, who are friends one uh, kind of friend zoned me and then said not interested after two weeks of contact well her friend initiated last night so I sent uh, my phone number because I don't use messenger and uh, we messaged for half hour then I called and we had a in-depth discussion for a couple hours and made plans to go out on the boat um, I had plans for this weekend, and all of my friends, in quotations, uh, ditched me. Um, don't know why, uh, but anyways, that kind of set me off. And then the, the game that these two friends were playing with me, and she... Uh, <clears throat> started following me around on social media and laughing emojis and making comments calling me a kitten instead of a lion basically went to all of the posts that I posted this weekend because I was trying to get a date for the weekend and have somebody go out with me on the motorcycle or on the boat or Independence Day or the beach and I offered myself and my toys up, and uh, all I got was craziness. Uh, lies, uh, you know, the typical woman. Oh, I'm not like the other women. Um, yeah, I'm honest. I'm faithful. I don't play games. And guess what it turned out to be? Games. Turned out to be bizarre. Um, I'm just... Uh, blown away. This is um, 25 or 26 since April of 21. Uh, I thought it was going to be different with my so-called friend in quotation. And of course uh, launch day uh, text on me this morning after I texted to see how work went with her yesterday and how things were and give a status report on the cat that I acquired because of her. Um, yeah, I ended up uh, running a cat over a couple weeks ago and felt so bad. And I figured I'd make it up by taking on a junkyard stray. And this friend was going to take on the junkyard stray, but couldn't because of the situation at her home. So I figured this junkyard stray named Jinx, would bring us closer together and give said friend a reason to come see me. And yeah, that backfired, so now I've got a cat. Uh, the cat is becoming loving and uh, has a food issue because it, it was hunting for its food unless people fed it. So that's another story for another video, but um, men... If you're watching this, and women, especially women, I want you to prove me wrong in my assertion and assumption and comments. I've posted it in another video. 
I would like somebody, some female, to set a new example, uh, comment, um, yeah, uh, why do you do this, and why do you blame men, why do you say it's the men's fault, why do you say the man destroyed you, why do you lead us on, why do you uh, initiate, is it for validation, attention, dopamine high, uh, for whatever sick, deranged reason, I'm tired of it. The damage has been done. The initial damage was done from a long-term relationship that uh, ended when I didn't want it to. And uh, I wanted to marry said person. And nope, that when I said, uh, showed pictures of a ring and made discussions, um, I got ghosted initially. So that hurt. And that actually has sparred uh, smoking, which has now, I think, turning into COPD because I went from smoking maybe a few cigarettes a day to uh, a pack a day um, because I was ghosted and I had no reason what the hell happened and it hurt so bad. And then I got a Dear Sean letter and so we became friends, got back in contact and I don't know what happened with that, but I ended up, uh, because I didn't know for several months what was going on um, after work, I had nothing to do, uh, no girlfriend, uh, I ended up smoking a lot and got what I would call, consider smoke inhalation several times and, uh, and now the damage is done, so... Thank you for that. And people could say, oh, it's your fault. You smoked. Uh, no, you try being ghosted after you wanted somebody that you'd been in love with for over a decade. <laughs> I hear that? <clears throat> yeah. Uh, to uh, ghost you initially and then to ghost you again and again while they seek uh, attention and validation and probably have a new relationship that they gained from she gained from online, don't know, don't know what's going on, tried to make contact, uh, blocked from social media, uh, I think the texts went through, don't know, um, I wish she would talk, I wish she would tell me what transpired, I wish I could get closure, um, but I can't, but I will always cherish that time, she was the best in my life, so, I would, um, really like to find somebody that truly loved me and was not going to hurt me and play games and I'm usually pretty clear headed level headed but I think I'm getting PTSD from all of these encounters. I've kept the texts and a couple of messages. I have been uh, stalked by several I have been damaged, and I guess I'm going to have to heal. I figured I could try to move on and find somebody else, but the attempts in the last year have resulted in <clears throat> more damage and more bizarre actions, uh, stalking, uh, I'm just, I'm out of sorts, but my channel here used to be videos about my travels and stuff, and well, thanks to the brand and economy and administration, that has ceased. A $500 increase in my budget has taken fun money and travel money and uh, an exorbitant tax bill because of my business, which is under $10,000 has now, is going to deplete my uh, savings. So, thank you, Brandon. Well, I guess I'll end this video for now because I'm rambling and I think my point has been made. Men, uh, beware. MGTOW is happening for a reason. 
Uh, women just are not the same. I do not know what's going on in society. I've read articles about social media and dating apps, and I've experienced it myself now. It's uh, painful. I try to go out and meet women, and the interest uh, last night's was uh, a whole 12 hours. Yeah, I wake up and turn my phone on, and yeah, uh, I, I'm going to have to pass because I had too much alcohol last night. Talk to you later. Um, so I responded back, talk to me later. When? Today? Uh, tomorrow? Uh, next week? Never? Um, you had mentioned lying, women lying. She said that women were liars and played games, so there is self-admittance from an elderly woman. So you tell me, women, why do you do this? Why do you blame men when you initiate actions as that? Why did you uh, gain interest in me when your friend did and I had a little go-around with her this last week? Um, not interested was the last text I got after I thought we had a connection and... Apparently not. And then said woman followed me around 